Morehouse is a faith-based organization. So we, uh, we are motivated by something deeper, uh, by our belief that, that we can't make a difference in this world. Our primary obligation is not to live our lives for ourselves. Tell you a little story is in Nairobi, Kenya, in the slums of Nairobi. In visiting with them, I thought about the courthouse and I said, You know, is there something that a couple thousand dollars could help you with? And immediately, the director, her name is Mary, she said, You know what? We have uniforms for all of our children, so we would like for you to raise money for us to buy a loom. And I came back and I put on a little poster, we're gonna buy, we're gonna raise money for a loom for sweaters for kids in Kenya, Africa. We sent it to them. Next time I went back, I walked into a room that was full of sweaters, full of sweaters, and five looms. Now they have women making sweaters all day long. And it's because of the poorhouse that that happened. Um, and there are other stories like that. I'm sorry, I get, I get a little emotional about this stuff because it's my passion. And when I know that we've been able to just take a few tips and turn them into something real for people who don't have what they need, um, that, that, that works, gets me worked up. You know what I mean? We don't want to be just the best coffee shop in town. We want to be a place that makes a difference in the world. And that when people enter here, they know that they're participating in something much bigger, kind of like the global guest idea, except I think what we do is, is uh, very direct. And, and I, have, I can take photos every time of every project that we've helped to, to do because I know it was completed, and I know that every penny that was get put in a tip jar or, or given uh, by students, community people, is going to the place we said it would with no administrative costs whatsoever. So um, we're really proud of that.